Hi, it's Eunice at Aerial Practice. Just a few weeks ago, I shared 10 basic aerial helmet tricks with you, and some of you have already tagged me on Instagram to share your practice with me. It makes me very happy to see them, and it also inspired me to share 10 more aerial helmet tricks with you today. Some of the tricks in this video are similar to the first one, but it will be more advanced. Some will require more strength. If you find them challenging, there are two aerialist floor workouts to prepare you for the air. The first trick today is entering the hammock with a fan kick. First, I'm facing the hammock, placing my grip in front of my chest, practice drawing half circle with my left leg, then right leg, and back. Practice this movement one more time. Now, adding some core strength to do the trick. Practice toward a slow and control movement. Sitting on the hammock to continue to the second trick. Grab the opposite side of the silks and pull them to create a cross in front. I'm going to throw the legs through the hammock, but first practice leaning upper body back in this position, then swinging the lower body to create the momentum. Then combine both movements to land in the superman position. Keep pulling back, back to sitting, and repeat one more time. The third trick is from sitting to a straddle. From the sitting position, I'm placing my grip next to my ears, slightly pulling my body off the hammock, then opening the legs to straddle. And repeat one more time. From here, I'm going to practice this rotating movement. I'm bending my left leg to bring it in, pointing my right leg to the back and down. Bringing the right leg back and bend, straightening my left leg and pointing back. Practicing this for two more times. I'm engaging my thigh muscles to keep the legs rotate in the same horizontal line for a cleaner look. Come back up, placing the hammock on my back to practice another entry with a fan kick. Drawing a big circle with my left leg, followed by the right leg to hook onto the silk. Now the other side. Going directly to trick six. Let's go back and start from a straddle. Bend the left leg, grab the hammock, and straightening the legs. I'm pulling myself up 
and keeping both legs straight and strong to bring my feet together. Here you can play with different shapes. I'm going to show you the other side with the fan kick entry from Trek 5. Circle the left leg and hook the right. Pull up and bring the feet together. Keeping the legs strong can reduce the pain from wrapping the thighs. Trick 7 is a backflip on the hammock. I'm leaning down to put my weight on the hammock, tucking the knees to my chest, straightening my left leg to the back, and right leg up. Opening up to a split, and bringing my upper body up. Here is the other side. Remember to keep using the grip to support the movement. Next, I'm going to bring this to the air. Same logic as before, except this time I'm bringing my left foot to the silk and begin with a pull-up. Now, right foot to the silk. Next trick is an inverted split. I'm going to show you step by step. First, tucking the knee up to go into a pike. Then left leg to the back and switch legs if this is challenging check out the floor exercise for strengthening the last trick is a follow-up of the standing trick if you haven't yet, be sure to try the other 10 basic hammock tricks. Start by standing on the hammock. Bring the left leg to the front. And hook it onto the sill. Slightly pulling myself up while straightening the left leg and bending the right. Now turning my body to the back to return to the beginning. One more time on the other side. Then I'm going to show you some tricks with music.
Is there any tricks in your practice that I didn't cover? Feel free to tag me on Instagram or leave a comment below to let us know. If you would like to see more hammock and hoop practice, click subscribe now so you can see the new videos that we upload on aerial practice every week. Thank you for joining us today and see you in the next video.